Hey guys, this is Game of Three Ten Thousand and One with Part Three of Mario World. I accidentally recorded Part Four instead of Part Three, and I beat some stuff that I didn't do it. And I started a special one on part 4, so part 3 and part 4 will be uploaded. And in part 4, I'm starting the special world. And just now you're going to see some anger. In levels like Star World 5, but in Star World 5, you won't see that much anger. Because I'm not really angered by Star World 5 if I have a Blue Yoshi. But if I'm regular Mario, then I will get pretty mad, and pretty mad at it. Now, um, now I had someone say that apparently my videos are too bright, and I believe that too. They are kind of bright, but it's the only option that I have, so I pretty much have to record like this. Now, as for, ac as for accidentally recording the part four, I started the special world in part 4 and I got to Star World 5 and it last ends 12 minutes long. I will be uploading both of these as soon as my parents approve them. Which I don't think that should be too long because one's 12 minutes long and the other one's 15 minutes long and they never have the time to, uh, um, to approve them so that's why I never have videos out that fast. I'm pretty sure I'll over like the over like uh, places at times like spring break and March and stuff, I probably will have a whole lot of videos up. Now the green switch helps right here because it serves as a platform right here and you get a power up right here too. And this boss is Morton. Uh, Morton's not Morton's not hard at all. He's just hit him three times and he dies. See, that was easy. It wasn't hard at all, was it? And I made it to where Mario looks like he's flying in the air, but he's on the ground. Looks like he's actually in a windy area. Here we got the message. Why is Mario? Oh, oh. why is Mario kicking a castle and? Think and stomping on it. I didn't know it was that strong. Morton Cooper Jr. of Castle 2 is now just remembering the next area is the underground Manila Dome. What traps await Mario in this new world? What will become a Princess Toastal? I don't know, Mario. Well, what do you think is going to happen? Not much. Now, as you can see, I already pressed the red switch and I already did all that stuff because I thought I was doing part four instead of part three so I'll be showing those levels in a bonus in bonus videos meaning that I drive the game I will do those in a bonus video now I said that I think Nintendo overuses the cape too much in this game because why would they they use the cape a little bit too much why did I get the fire flower? See it when I press the red switch, the red outline is filled. Here's the secret exit. Now, if you don't press the red switch, you will have to either dismount off Yoshi or fly up there. Flying up there isn't really e isn't very easy. Now I'm gonna find the normal exit. Now, now as in Tiger, um, I was watching his uh, his newest video, and he got really angry in that video. He's like screaming and stuff, and he's saying this game is crap and stuff, and that he doesn't want to play it anymore, and that he's done. And plus, he plus he gave it a bad rating too. Since my computer messed up, I was never able to see the rating. In some videos, my computer will not let me watch the video or anything. And I realized I got more views on my other videos now. I have seven subscribers now. One from another site. That one that I know from another site. His name is uh, Ugliest Rodentia. If you want to subscribe to him, 
Now, however, he's been at the site. He's been at the site. He's been helping me on exploring where other stuff is going inside. He has gotten more posts than me than I than really fast. He must have been posting like every like 100 posts every day. Now the forum thing, the forum contest that I was doing with other users, I'm in the lead by like 170 posts. I guess he managed to reach 700 in a quick amount of time. I mean 300 in a quick amount of time. He says he would have the guild theme playing, but he didn't. I don't see why he wouldn't have. For the last thing, he had the guild theme playing, which was a good, which was a good one. Now I'm going to do the Manila secret area before I finish up the Manila dome. This one has a secret. Now this secret will lead to a certain part of the game that you can access but to get to the special world. Now as you sit through the game, we will run into places where we can access the um, the regular the star star road. And also my videos are one user says my videos are I need more energy to do commentary, but I'm like no. One user says my commentary is great, one user says my commentary is, I need more energy for it. Come on people, give me a choice. Should I have more energy or should I just do the regular stuff? And I just why did I just kill that poopa and take it with me? Looks like we'll be getting a normal exit because we don't have a certain switch and I think you need a certain switch to get this one. And I just got hit by a football truck. And we got no stars at all. Great. I realize it's like it's like 8.40 right now so my parents say I have to go to bed at like 9.30 which is not a good time to go to bed. Vanilla Secret 2. As you can see, this level is not underground. It's got yellow ground, which is really ugly. And I just died, very stupidly. I decided I'm going to find every secret in the game. Lori? I'm trying to figure out what I'm doing. Sorry, that was someone interrupting the video again. Sorry about that. As soon as I learn how to edit videos, I'll be editing those out. I'm gonna eat this scoop. So as you can see, when you get a green one, you just eat it and you're able to throw it out. And I just got hit again. Stupid Yoshi. You're the cause of everyone's death in this game. This level always gave me trouble, especially Butterbridge 1. This game never gets old. This game is like one of the best Mario games. It's one of the best Mario classics of all time in my opinion. We're gonna get a one-up probably. And I didn't get a one-up. I was hoping to get, at least get a one-up out of this, but... And there's Yoshi. He's right there. I guess Yoshi's... Could have found the way... Found the... Wait, uh, uh, got the ability to jump over cliffs. And here's a diagonal pipe. We'd shoot out of that if we could find a pipe that would do it. And this is just coins. Great, Nintendo. I was hoping for something better, like a cake or something. If you're gonna put something there. And that was just phenomenal. There's like 20 spinies over there. I'm pretty sure if I was gonna shoot. No, it leads to an area with a P-switch and lava and coins. And I get a Yoshi coin from it. And of course we shoot out of that pipe. I knew we would. Really, I didn't need to bounce on that Koopa at all. I didn't really need to do that at all. Now, I noticed, you notice my commentary is getting better from the first video. First video, I think my commentary just sucked. And I think this is a water level. Yes, it is. This is the level with the dolphins. Yep, it is. I've seen people literally change these. And are they wearing goggles? Dolphins are not supposed to wear goggles, Nintendo. Dolphins are supposed to swim in the water, not wear goggles. And go 
Goblins can see underwater. They don't need goggles. Just match up on Mr. Port Puffer. And I just died. Great. Just gonna spin jump on the pork of puffer over the entire level. But I died, so we had to restart all over again. And, and really dolph and really the palette of the dolphins is kinda good. But kinda bad at the same time. Really I like the palette of the dolphins, but and the Yoshi coin just respawned. It's a good thing. And these dolphins, there's a lot of dolphins here. Just keep endlessly coming. I guess this place is overpopulated or something. I don't know. Mr. Porky Puffer is catching up. And why is Midway Point in the air? Why, why do dolphins live in an area that has a Midway Point? These dolphins are very advanced creatures. And I'm running from a fish that has spikes all over. Can I make it? Yes! I made it. I got 4,000 points. And I got 8,000, which means we'll be able to get nothing at all. I'm gonna check the time. We have 11 minutes, so we have enough time to move on to Vanilla Fortress, but we won't be able to finish it though. Vanilla Fortress. Now, this is the only level that is an underwater fortress. It's kind of easy but kind of hard at the same time if you're new to underwater level underwater fortresses this is this is a hard level now as you can see some small mario i can go in this little gap and i can go down this pipe i was big mario i have to go i wouldn't be able to now this is a midway point no it's an area with swamp I didn't know Thwomp said to do that to breathe. Crush you to breathe. It's kind of weird. Thwomp's had nothing better to do except for crush you and try to kill you. They waste all their life doing that. I don't think they have anything better to do. If they had anything better to do, they would actually make something out of their life and go do something. And that's just a random pipe that doesn't do anything. Dude, seriously, Thwomp should just get a life and go do something. If Thwomp should just get a life and go do something, it'd be a lot better. Now, now in part four, I, um, I just want to let you know, part four, I, I, I finish up, um, I get the star, star road five. I get the star road five in part four. And also my dad interrupts the end, the end of that video. But that doesn't matter. It's only a small interruption, and plus I'm trying not to get mad with all these interruptions. And we just did this area, didn't we? Now, um... I just want to let you know in part 4 I do the special world and in part 5 I will be continuing the special world but in this part I do up to Vanilla Fortress. Now I'm trying to do, I'm going to try to finish Vanilla Fortress but first I have to see how much time we got. We got 13 minutes, 13 minutes. I think if we hurry we should finish this fortress at like 1505 or 1506 or, well I look, we're there. This is a bot new boss. If you've never seen Reznor, most of you have if you played this game. Now the platforms disappear on both sides. But for this battle, they don't do it like they do in the other battles. I just realized that I'm doing something very deadly right now. Mario can do very deadly things and live. And Mario, how is Mario able to even escape from this? In the next part, um, how is Mario able to escape from this? How is Mario able to escape from this? And I doubt we'll be able to finish this level. This level doesn't have auto scrolling, and it it has auto scrolling, and plus it has these platforms, these very annoying platforms. When you stand on one, the other one will rise. I should say, I'm going to start, like, if you have any challenge videos for, like, the bonus ones, I would like you to send it to me so that you can tell me if you want to. And, uh, I'm sorry, that, I'm sorry that the part had to end with death, but this has been Gamer Freak 10,001. I'll see you guys later. In the next part, we will be doing the special world. See you guys.